HIPAA, the Health Insurance Portability and Accountability Act, provides patients with a legal right to access their health information. It's crucial that we allow patients appropriate access while protecting their privacy. Consider these seven keys to ensure the right info reaches the right people at the right time. Number one, remember, HIPAA requires any healthcare provider or organization that maintains protected health information to provide patient access to it. Next, protected health information, or PHI, includes a person's past, present, or future physical or mental health or condition, as well as any related care or payment data. Any information that provides a reasonable means of identification, such as a name on a schedule, is protected. Third, the benefits of patient access include higher survey scores and more engaged patients who are better prepared for their office visits, motivated to improve self-care, and more involved in their future health decisions. Number four, requested records must be provided in their entirety, no matter how old the information is, where it's kept, or where it originated. Exclusions include psychotherapy notes kept separately, PHI compiled for litigation, or records not used to make decisions about the patient. You can't prevent access over a patient's failure to pay for care, or because they may not understand the information or be upset by it. Number five, any individual or authorized personal representative can request the info at any time for any reason. You may require a written request, which can be electronic, and you must verify identity. Providers should offer several ways to obtain info in the patient's requested format, if readily available, without unreasonable delays. The patient can also specify how it's transferred, including mail or email, even unsecure email. You must allow access, even if the patient will do something with the data that isn't in their best interests, like putting it online or using an application with poor security. Sixth, access within 30 days is required, with one 30-day extension permitted. Providing free copies is strongly encouraged. Patients must sign a written request to have their PHI transmitted to a third party, including their primary care physician, loved ones, a caregiver, mobile health applications, or a research institution. Finally, at number seven, be incredibly careful in guarding patient information, directly or indirectly. That includes what you post on social media and things you say and do in the office. Even small slip-ups jeopardize patient security and your job. That's your HIPAA overview. Follow those seven steps to safeguard patient privacy while getting them the information they need when they need it.